Welcome to Cross Culture New Mexico. I'm your host, Mark Tross. We're going to continue our series on Rosh Hashanah, the Jewish New Year, which is taking place even as I'm speaking. And we've been talking about the prophetic fulfillment, and we're going to continue this series with some hopefully interesting insights to you that you'll pass along to others. Historical evidence seems to indicate the month of Elul served as the perfect time of preparation for the greatest spiritual message ever to come to Israel, return to God. Messiah has come. Not only has Messiah come, he is coming again. And there is a rich prophetic truth associated with this Feast of Trumpets, which comes the sounding of the shofar. I showed you this in previous videos here on YouTube. This is an extra large ram's horn, front and back for you to see but as it characterizes a time of in gathering and spiritual preparation be holy as i am holy sanctify yourself the scripture says the future fulfillment of rosh hashanah is also alluded to and speaking of the future regathering of believers in messiah commonly called the rapture rabbi Sor, the apostle paul reveals an interesting connection to the holy day 1 Thessalonians 4, 16 through 18 reads this, For the Lord himself will come down from heaven with a rousing cry, with a call from one of the ruling angels, and with God's shofar. Then we who are those who died united with the Messiah will be the first to rise. Then we who are left still alive will be caught up, which is a Latin word, which means rapture, with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. And thus we will always be with the Lord. So encourage each other with these words. 1 Thessalonians 4, chapters 16 through 18. Now this holy day is a perfect picture of the regathering of believers. In the future, all true believers in Yeshua, Jesus. Yeshua is his Hebrew name, which means Messiah, which means the Christ, which means the anointed one. It means salvation. We'll be gathered to meet him in the clouds. The dead and Messiah will rise first to be followed immediately by those believers alive at the time. Not surprisingly, the signaling of the gathering will be the sound of the shofar. In fact, the reference here is to a particular note sounded at Rosh Hashanah, which we spoke about in previous videos here on YouTube, the word normally translated shout in verse 16 comes from the Hebrew teruah, which means better translated in its context as the alarm, the blast of the shofar, like your alarm going off. Ba, 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 ba. The blast of the shofar references to the shofar as the signal of the rapture can be found 50 to 58 and Revelation 4 verse 1. Be sure to check out our website crossculturenm.weebly.com as well as like and share our Facebook pages. Sign up for Cross Culture NM on YouTube and connect with us on LinkedIn and other social media sites. <laughs>